Hey y'all, what's going on? I am back with you guys and I'm sharing with you my unboxing of my new shoes I got in the mail today. And I'm going to start getting into a habit of doing these unboxing videos. That way you guys know what to expect. If you want to know what to expect when getting a package from, you know, these places or if you're considering going where I got to get shoes or whatever. That way you know like, oh, okay, it should come like that or, you know, hers came like this or that. You know, you know the whole thing. So, so. I ordered a pair of shoes from semishoes.com and I'm gonna go ahead and open these up. Opening up, as you can see, I just ripped it open and it came, eh, it, it, took, it, it took it a minute. I mean, it's coming from the UK. It's, was through the Royal Mail or just USPS. Uh, so here's the box. It says, Simi, love your shoes. I don't know if you can see that. And size, they're a size six in the UK. So they were $28 in pounds, 28 pounds. Over here, they, it all came up to 58. And I'm not too sorry about that. So it comes, ooh, y'all, the box went through it. I actually do wish that they put it in a sturdier box or something other than just this because this kind of went through it. I mean, you would think something heavy probably smashed it. I mean, look at this, y'all. Ooh, Jesus. You would think something heavy smash or something? I mean, it, for me, that worries me because I'm like, dang, this could have cracked a heel or broke a heel off or something, anything. Shoes.com. So it's S I M M I shoes. All right. <laughs> they do have the specs, so I don't have to pull it up on my phone or the invoice. I have the Gina, they're called the Gina uh, 2 Women's High Heel Fur. And the, the shipping, US standard shipping was $11.99 and the price of the shoe itself was $42. Uh, just a little FYI, I, oh and I think I ordered these on the 11th and today is the 20th. Yes, today is the, is the 20th. Just a little FYI, if you are trying to order these on like your boyfriend's credit card or your mom's credit card or a credit card that someone or somebody is trying to buy it for you from somewhere else and their billing is not the same as the shipping, you're gonna be out of luck. Your billing and your shipping have to be the same. And I actually had a card tied to an old address that I have to actually get changed. But it shipped, it shipped it to the old, it, the house, nobody lives there anymore, thank goodness. So I had to go to the post office and pick up my package because the shipping and billing situation like that. So um, now we are getting to opening them up. And again, y'all see that box was smashed to hell. That is very unnerving. But oh, look at them. Aren't they cute? Ooh, already. Just. They are cute, but ugh, I don't know if they're, if like the glue, um, maybe they didn't let the glue dry, I guess, but it's like a random feather just stuck to the glue. I don't know, is this, I, let me see if it's on autofocus. It's on autofocus, okay. Y'all see that? I don't know if I like that now. Um, so I gotta take the feather off right there. And just so you know, there's not supposed to be no feathers right here, y'all. So I'm not messing up the shoe. 
they just I guess they didn't let the or the or it caught it or something. I don't know. Like I said, this is the honest, honest first reaction of this. So you're gonna wanna stick around with this video. If it takes a little longer, you're definitely gonna wanna stick around. Okay. Oh the smell is very industrial. As you can see, there are it's it's a very cute shoe. It seemed like they just kind of, they were kind of just messy with it. I mean, right here, I don't know if it's too close or if you can see it, but like there's kind of like a glue mess right there. I don't know. I gotta rip that out, I guess. So, uh, all right. Yeah, the glue kind of went over. Ugh. All right, so obviously a little cosmetic things that throw me off at first glance. Uh, the fur is definitely, uh, um, furring is definitely fluffy. I do like that. I assume that they're on here by some sort of glue or something. Uh, I, these, oh, what? Okay, something hard is right there. I don't, I can't just let that go. So that's gotta be, I gotta be the same here. Okay, I gotta be the same here, so I was gonna take this off. Okay, like a little hard piece, let's just hang it. I don't know. Um, they're really cute, they just look, kind of rushed like they just had the, like the demand is high I get a girl hey girl time I guess she done sold these bad boys out because they hurry up and try to rush these things together they look cute from they definitely you will definitely be able to see nothing from far away so if you don't have somebody all in your bunions then you definitely kind of want to watch it but uh, maybe four inches or five inches or something. All around it's a pretty clean shoe except for all of that. But it says semi shoes, love your shoes in the inside. Right there. I think it's really cute and classy. So let's check out the other one. This one has a misshapen feather. They're not really the same shape of fur, feather fur. Kind of different, but I don't know if to just let that fly, let that be. I don't know if I should let that be. I'm gonna try to just shape. You gotta, okay. You know how you gotta shape a wig when you first get it? Uh, if you don't like how it looks or whatever, you're gonna have to do that with these shoes. So you're gonna have to like shape a feather here and there. Oh my gosh, the glue, y'all. Y'all see that? It's a little messy. All that, it's just a little messy. Something right there, that's a little messy. There, woo, woo. I mean, ain't nobody gonna be looking all in my bunions anyway, so I'm not about to be, I'm not gonna sit up here and be petty, but I definitely, some people are stickular though. Like I've seen some girls on YouTube who will open up stuff and if they, they see this kind of stuff, they'll, they're done. Like they're just like, ooh wait, no, no, no. But I'm not too picky. I'm still gonna wear the hell out of this shoe because these are my, these are also my birthday shoes. So I'm a little, I'm, I definitely am inspecting them because these are my birthday shoes. But all in all, I love them, I like them. Yeah, I don't know, I'm not gonna have this video be all day. Now I will say <laughs> I love them, but uh these are definitely not something something that you would wear for uh hours 
<laughs> these definitely have to be worn sitting down or for just a few hours so yeah all right so i love them my first reaction is that they're a little thrown together they are a little bit messy but i really do love them <laughs> uh i will be ordering from them again i will say that they are affordable and really chic so i will be ordering from them again moving on real quick because this is a pretty long video i said i didn't want it to be long but it ended up being long I apologize for that. But uh, I got this really cute watch. I did want to share with you guys. I got this really cute watch for free. or well, not really for free. I think I paid like $2 in shipping from Wish. So, uh, you know, when you get on Wish or when you first sign up, you get, I think, like a free gift or something. So, you get to choose. Uh, they have a select few that they want to give away. And this was one of them. I don't have a watch. And I really don't need one. I don't care for watches. But I was like, I don't have a watch. So let me just get a watch. And it is really cute. It had this little charm on it. And it's like a little peacock or something. With a little diamond peacock. Uh, it's, it, it's gold. It just looks like money. I feel like when a woman got a watch on, she just looks like she's about her business. Like she's a boss. Like, yeah, I got somewhere to be. You know. And oh, the size that I wear is a UK size 6, but in America, I wear 8. And I think time advised for you to go up a size. I'm going to advise that you stay true to your size because I still had room since your feet. I don't know if she said go. She may, Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know if she said you can go up a size or go down a size because... I think she said go up because your feet slide down, but I personally would just stay with my size because your feet slide down. I don't know, like for me, I don't want to see like a girl with a big old gap back here, but that's just me. I think that, you know, go with your size and to be mindful that night to back them feet up into this heel because I don't, I don't know, that's just me. But yeah, that's all guys. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. It's already pretty long. I hope you guys stuck around for the long haul and you guys know that I like to talk. So um, I will tell them when to, <laughs> to skip this video for all the people who just wanna see it <laughs> and see what the unboxing. But you guys have a great day. I will be back with more content and remember to keep up with me, be patient with me because of stuff like this. <laughs> all right, y'all have a great day. Bye. Yeah.